NERC Standard Mod 25. What's its purpose? And what should you expect? We sat down with one of our experts and asked those very questions. Let's take a look. So Mod, mod 25 is to be test, we want to test to make sure the generator can function the way it's supposed to from a real power capacity and a bar production capacity. They want to make sure it can do what it's supposed to if it's called upon during an event like the Northeastern Blackout. So they, they do that testing to ensure it, you do, they will get those bars. The uh, grid folks who do the analysis assume and use a certain value for that machine. It's got a certain capability. So many watts, so many bars, and so many NDA total megawatts or megavolts, megavolts, amperes, reactive. They also they look at that and they and they are analyzing the system and they're going to do system upsets. They're going to fault transmission lines. They're going to fault generators. They might fault multiple transmission lines <coughs> or multiple generation. What they're going to do and the reason and what what happens is that the program they use is going to try to correct itself and see where it can pull that loss of load or loss of generation. We usually call it load. Uh, so I got to be careful about that. That loss of generation, they want to uh, rechannel that from some other place. Well, that other place is those units that are running. And you lose generation, you're going to lose power production, and you're going to lose watt production and a real real power coming out of the machine. It has to come from someplace else. Typically, you have that in your other generators, it's called spinning reserve. And they're going to want to make sure that they have enough generations in this simulation, leftover generation, to help that faulted condition, lost generation or lost transmission line. They want to make sure these generators out here are picking up, but they, they base it on data from the generator. All right, all that information comes in from the generator saying it's good for this many watts and this many bars. My 25 is testing to make sure you can have that many megawatts and that many megawatts. It's actually testing it to make sure it will do what you say it will do based on how they simulate it. So it's a, it's a validation of the simulation values, make sure that the values being told to the guys who do the studies on the grid, it'll actually do what it's supposed to. That's what the Mod 25 is doing.